guys. Soul Art's here, only because I don't want to move off the couch. Um, good. All right. We end this. We got Mid Hudson versus the Grunts of the Gang, and it is already three. How is what is what just happened? He really just okay. So um. Old has a wild lead. Is this magic bad for Ollie? Probably. That's who I wouldn't do. The pole just kind of saucing him up right now. They start on even terms, or huh? They start on even terms three stocks. Yeah, all right. Yeah, he just got he just got body. Who is Grunt Gang gonna send out next? For those who don't know, Grunt Gang is actually a Wi-Fi crew that are like really good friends, and they all just all you know chill and okay. play together. Uh, please stop. What? He's on like him? on me. He's like touching me in places I'm walking. Uh, the armor I think is like frame five. I don't. I, don't quote me. I actually, but I know. I know it's like at least frame five or below. I also know that Bowser's a really cool character. Oh, this is the is the, the DD player, right? But I feel like the I feel like this team just went through the same order throughout the entire bracket. No, you don't. No, you don't. Cause, no, no, oh, no, cold, cold. All you do is ban stages, and then he 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 can counterpick you, but he but you can. Oh no 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 you don't. So 15 to 12, Mid Hudson's starting off really strong right now. With a three stock lead. So I think this is the DDD player. So what do you, what do you think Cold will ban based off that? And they're going PS2. Why am I not surprised? No, okay. Um, yeah, I was going to say that he probably banned uh, FD because he plays Prom and he likes plats for, for platform extensions. And then, uh, I don't know what his other ban would be. Maybe Oh, uh, it's my tag. Oh. Alright, so let's see if uh, Cold can sauce this guy again or if he, uh, he falls him. Let's see if Hudson even needs their Bowser. Yeah. You're the, you'll always be the better Bowser, it's fine. Yeah. I mean, they don't have a Bowser, it's just kidding. No. I, I was making a reference to how I like just never played. Would you like going for them, illegally? What do you mean? Like, just go on their team? Well, I'm not gonna go on their Just trade teams? <laughs> we'll, take, uh, we'll take that Ralph player and trade you off, how's that sound? No! Alright. So, both players are kind of getting a footing and seeing what they want to do in this matchup. I'm pretty sure Cold wouldn't know this matchup. Diggy's not a very common character. No, yeah. But you never know what dwells in Mid Hudson, so. Also, like, um, Diggy isn't a character that you're just like, oh, big body, like a little dupa. Not really, not in most matchups. Like, right there, sure. But, like, once it, once it comes to the higher percents, uh, he is. Diggy may be the third heaviest character, but he's the second heaviest character to kill off the top. Which is bonkers. Ooh, good and, timing. Okay. He knows about the armor. Yep. There's a. Uh, yeah, whenever whenever Shulk can backslash sludge, GD will do that to me sometimes. Yeah, because it's crazy. Armors. You should you should start doing that. When whenever he backslashes, you just you just punch him. Bro, can you not give him advice? Thanks. Please, thanks. I'm I'm giving him my my advice on when I play DK in Smash Word Four. Okay, you know what? Backslash didn't snap Legend Four, so you shouldn't know that. No, but what I do know. Is that you can whiff punish your fair What I do know is this DDD just got off the ledge. Surprise, surprise. The DDDs are doing way better than the Olimar from the first match. Um, I feel like the problem with Grunt Gang is they have a set order. Instead of, you know, kind of picking up on who's up right now. Yeah, it's the same order when we played them. So Kenny up just abandoning corner pressure. He's not really, like, keeping him trapped on the ledge. He's just backing off the center stage when he really should. He's, re he's just really respecting him. No, because the problem with DDD that people that I think Cold is understanding is that DDD has, although being in the air you're in disadvantage. DDD has multiple jumps and pretty large hitboxes, and you know some of those hitboxes, like the giant ass hammer, can contest to the uh, sword. Okay, makes sense. Even yeah, I don't. Yeah, what, what I was referencing before more is like he was on stage already. Like no, not I know, on the yeah, I, I know what you mean, but like I'm I'm telling you that like if like a DDD like like. 
for instance, is in the corner as he is right now, yeah. or was, and then the Krom would like, start pressuring him. It could work if he's on ledge, but once he's on stage, it's better to back off and give the heavy, you know... Space to, like... Some space, because you gotta understand, he, he takes up a lot of, of an area, you know? He takes, he's really big. So he doesn't have much room to go, despite there being a decent amount of room. Okay. If that makes any sense. Oh, not for the roll. That was chase. Yeah. That was... Okay. Really trying to use the Gordo. Yeah, he keeps messing up. Cause the second time in a row, he messed up catching. Right? Yeah. So it seems that Coldus is playing that, you know, really safe playstyle, not really... He's playing so... He's I mean, playing like, slow, he's, he's not approaching, He's approaching, but he's picking his options when to go in, you know? He's, he's choosing, he's playing very carefully. He's not playing button matchy Chrom, which I commend him for that, because a lot of Chroms love, love going in, but Coldus is not showing it. Will he get oh, it? Oh, 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 I missed time that time. Oh, I remember what said now. Nice movement, nice lay on the platform. Oh, I feel like people should utilize Wavelength more with their characters, you know? Really? On the platform, because it looks like they're gonna jump in and then you Wavelength back, they go for a punch, they go for an option to, to try to counter that, they whiff, you go down punish. Ah, oh, that's the He messed up on that recovery. He tried, he tried to get oh, too a little aggressive. bit too low. No, he was too far out. Yeah. He went, he went too, a little bit too far. But do you hear being the super heavyweight? He is not... Krom's not really having an easy time killing him here. Yeah. Despite Krom having absolutely kind of bonkers kill confirms on Pink Head. Can we get two frame? Thing is though, when you're two framing with a move like a uh, flare bleed, you gotta be really careful because sometimes DD can just go up but past the ledge and hit you. Armor and then hit you, yeah. 172. Oh, he, that was a good recovery. Okay, that was actually a good recovery mix up. Unfortunately, though, Cole was there to punish the roll. Relatively even, although Mizhatsu does, does have a whole three stock lead. Right now, that, Ooh. Just, Ooh. that just what? Just backfired on him entirely. Nice reaction. Just playing Krom, reacting to whatever he's doing. Yep. Uh oh. Come up, come up stage? Oh, that was a great forward there. Definitely looking for the jump or the air dodge. Mm -hmm. Which he did not get from either. Ooh, that was a really good read. Good stuff from Cold. So who are they gonna send up next? You said you mentioned before they have like kind of a set order. Yeah, I is think it the raw player next? No, the raw oh. player's last. Okay. Oh, I guess they're going with Quid this time. The trainer, right? Yeah, they had the uh, last time they had the Wii Fit, but now it's the trainer. He's still, so I mean, he has one stock, and it's the trainer. You know, he's just, both both uh, almost at both mods. Um, both both characters have pretty explosive ways. kill power. Yeah, not only that, but also just they're both extremely oppressive. You know, Squirtle, yeah. Ivysaur, and Zard at some points just don't want you to play the game. And same thing with Krom. Krom doesn't want you to play the game. Joy-Con warrior. <laughs> only problem though in this matchup is that yeah, he has Joy-Con. The only problem that I see is that uh, Squirtle being way too small, and then Ivysaur just humongous dare head boxes. Kind of, you know, body and recovery. It's just a matter of uh, if this trainer QU can uh, kill Cold's momentum. He's a lot of momentum riding into this match. Still, alive. yeah. Remember, he only has one stock. So, although he does have momentum, if Cold just takes one stock, just one, then Mid Hudson is in a, an extremely good, good uh, lead right here. But when I mean, they already have four stocks. Uh, yeah, he's not, he's not approaching. Not making the first move. Neither is Squirtle. He has the lead. I mean, in the game, yes, but not... Like, by default, he has the lead. I mean, yeah, exactly. If he times him out, would he win? If the Squirtle times him out, yeah. Okay. Then they lose their stock. But it's just, you know, waiting a whole 10 minutes for just one stock. Yeah, it's not worth it. Like, we were, we were, we were here to play some Super Smash Bros., you know, not just stand around. Well, not only that, but, like, um... I, oh, oh, oh. Good oh. combo, good combo. He should have went for another up air, up air fair, or just up air fair. 
double really damage. One good gimp off stage. Water yeah, gun can do that. No Ivy like, Dare. Squirtle one into one into interaction, 71. And then he has like you know the ability to flood him off with the water gun or so Cole's you know, gotta be very careful here. Yeah, see that's why I like you know Colt's playstyle. He's not committing to anything crazy, but he's also, you know, playing on a safe distance where he's still able to do something. Just keeping them at sword's length. Yeah. Nice the recovery. recovery. I hit him, wow. Good. Most players would have just went off stage if they try to hit Squirtle, but now here's the, here's, here's the, one of the main threats in my opinion in this matchup. You think so? He has the projectile and a really long grab to pivot grab and then Can he get to there? Oh, why didn't he go for it? I guess he wasn't ready for it. Yeah. Although, you should always be ready for it. Also, this is Quiz's best uh, Pokemon. Surprise. Yep, That's this is why, projectile. Well, good stuff to Cole, taking out a good chunk of their team. It was six? Six. Six. Good job to Cole, taking out six stocks. Definitely the MV MVP so far of this match. Now bring it up. Uh, I, I, I always never know how to say his tag. I just say Infiscape. INF Escape. But uh, he plays Rob and Snake. I don't know which one he prefers. Recently, I've seen him playing a lot more Snake. Oh, this is the Rob player who knows him? Yeah, yeah. Okay. He also plays Snake, too. Yeah, I thought he was on the other team for... No, no, but they also have a Rob. Oh, okay. They both have a Rob. Okay. If this escape wins, we better see that ditto. I would like to see that ditto. I mean, but here's the thing. He also plays Snake. And I think as of recent, he's been favoring more towards the Snake than Rob. That's fair, yeah. Almost, bro, not yet. How's bracket looking? Got this, we have this place. No, I don't. Oh, copy, alright, alright. Alright, so he's going with the Rob here. Just five. Tell him, tell him that when when we win this, I'll give him the other rest. Oh, a little confident, huh? After after this is over, I'll give you the rest. I only have. To... Huh? He's throwing Good five. Combo. I'm throwing ten. Yes. Sorry, he's, he's covering the other five. Oh, so he's going to rob. Okay. Grab. Let's go for the upper. Oh, up to upper. Okay. See, I thought that you can match out fast enough to where that just doesn't work at, at that low of percent. But I guess either quick mashing isn't as superb as I thought, or this is true. No, the down tilt change does not work at that point. Yeah. Will we get him? <laughs> good, good, good tonight. It's kind of fun. Good reaction, quick. This might be it. Yeah. It could be his matchup. No, just give him, just give him. No, get Ryan and tell, tell Ryan to give him five. Good. Okay. Okay. Seems every time Squirrel touches Rob, he just explodes. So that is shield option. There's, is, what is Nair's frame data? Four, five? Three. I have no idea, bro. I don't well, play this character. Really <laughs> But it's, it's definitely a very quick move, so I could four or five is probably a good guess. Leaving himself open. That was not a, really a hard that punish. Was, yeah, that wasn't. Definitely could have gotten a lot more. Could have just you know, gotta throw him off stage to get the force match. Nice to catch him with gyro. All right, Zard's coming out. Now he's gotta watch out for kill throws. Uh, Fog throw definitely killed ledge right now. I'll I don't think up throw will. On plot will, yeah. Sure. Will okay. Lot's not that heavy in this game. That's oh, he, not he missed the plot. Yeah, See, that's plot he's done. Scare him doing something. Uh, is that it? Can he get the up smash? Uh, he 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 does no mash. Nope. Right. That's good, bro. Nice. 
nice. So, Rob still in kill percent. Yeah, okay, so what's he gonna call it? He's what, with the Abdello? Um, but it uh, looks like that, um, what's, his, what's his face, uh, Quid is getting really. Really antsy for the Yeah, kill. really, really antsy. Let's probably just take it slow, calm down a little bit, you know? Is oh, that it? Oh, wow. That was bad, yeah. There's no way that's gonna kill. Oh, where are you all the upbears? Nice reset. Get a lot of percent off of this, as we've seen multiple times. See, everyone does complain about Robert, but I can understand why. You know, he has really, really, really great character. But you can't ignore the fact that he is one of the worst disadvantages in the game. See, he lost Quid? neutral once at 99. You can't do anything about pressure. We're definitely making a comeback here. Can you get this? No, oh, barely he, missed time. I, bet, I think he tried a fast left back here. That would have been it. Oh. Tech chase? Oh. oh. Nice done, not rolling in. It's not letting him play the game whatsoever. He's oh. definitely the one in control of the pace of this match currently. That's it. That's it. Good stuff to quit. Definitely like helping even out that set, uh, the uh, stock count. <laughs> Grunt Gang definitely taking back a little bit of uh, Mid Hudson's momentum. Yeah, so definitely taking some of it. Slowly but sure. I have no idea who the next player is. I don't know anyone here, bro. I just know. Wow, it's only nine to seven now. Before it was thirteen nine. Oh yeah, dude, they're definitely evening it up. Quid can keep this. If keep it going. Just, just take one more take stock. One or two stocks. They're in good shape though. We thought it was over after Cold tearing them up. I never. But they're definitely never, bringing this back. I never think it's over in crew battles. Not in crew battles. What's up? Mm -hmm. who, I don't know who this is. He what? Uh. Battlefield. Interesting choice of stage. Uh, nah, Falco. Fal this is the Falco's best stage for sure. He has so many, so much off platform extensions. So much. I'm sure a uh, throw combo is up to helps. Platforms help with. Can that water going on deck? Okay. Uh, he might, if he just didn't double kill. This is the problem with this matchup. Squirtle is the main asset towards Falco because Falco cannot deal with small characters. Yo, that up here shield always gets me. It either pokes or you just don't expect and you just hit like top of your shield as it goes up. It just grinds my views. Nice. Oh, I forgot about the last two. Yeah, we've got to remember about that last hit from uh, Falco's folder. I got the two from. Uh oh. That's, that clicked him out. No! That's a. Muffin is not maintaining stage. He just wants to take the stock completely. Nice parry. We gotta play around all those cool options, especially up to back air. Ooh, that's sour spot. Don't go off stage. There you go. Yeah, Muffin's gotta just maintain stage and just hold it, because Falco cannot afford to go off stage like that. No. He read the jump, but he didn't space it correctly. Good, good showing from Quid though. Did a very good job. Took a, took a, definitely brought it closer even than it was before. You know, he. Oh, they're, they're putting, they're putting, they're, they're, they're putting in Charles right away. He definitely softened the blow that Cole did to their team. So they're saving their Wii Fit for last. Um, is he their best player? Or? This is their best player. Okay. So we got we didn't have Rob Falco. Either Rob Falco or Wolf Falco. He plays both. He also plays Snake, but mainly Rob and Wolf. Yep. Rob. And I'm just gonna change that tag. Alright, Rob Falco. What do you think this matchup is? 
very confusing matchup it seems like on Yeah, mainly because they just really explode each other. Rob being a big character is something Falco and definitely enjoys well the combo rouse and Rob's advantage state. But at I the same time, this. Rob can also just blow him up off stage. Rob's got guardian capabilities. Also, yeah. his reflector, there you go, see? There you go. <laughs> I can definitely see him as being close to even, uh -oh. maybe slight Falco. Uh oh. Yeah, I already took 70 off of just basically uh -oh. one hit. Uh oh. I'm not letting him play the game at all. Ooh, that was, that was a weird hitbox. Oh, so he's got to he stop doing that. He's scaring me whenever he does that. Oh, nice, nice way on the platform. Good back air. And then Hustle is showing them that they're, they're, they're still dominant. Oh. Ooh, nice forward hit. Yeah, that pressure. See, like, Rob's, like, only real answer to getting out of this advantage is either his fast forward air or going high. Which both have their problems. Like, going high. Pretty much every character in the game, unless I'm like messing out on a few, can just definitely react to Rob's landings and just, you know, cover them. So Falco's really good at, you know, holding advantage state, getting these combos. Muffin is showing us here how that plays out because if you don't remember, Charles had three stocks and now he's. now he's down. The back air two frame? Huh? Can Rob's back air two frame? Yeah, Rob's back air is ginormous. It's also active for like almost 20 frames. It's crazy. But like the sweet spots are only like, like a few. I don't know. Okay. I just know it's really active and it's definitely two frames. I've done it before. Okay, let's go. Mess up the conversion. Ooh, it just jabs out instead of holding shield. I was gonna take it, Rob. I mean, Rob. Falco's back here still proving to be really strong. Definitely close to an even game right now, I would say. Yeah, one, one, uh, one slip up from Falco can mean death off stage. Something I really want to see Muffin do more is get some more grabs. Because grab it can do the same thing as up tilt in terms of combo routes. And you condition shield by, you know, up tilt. That's it. Good off smash out of shield. Really good. Recognize that that move was unsafe. Alright, so it's 3 to 6? 3 to 6. No. Yeah. What is it? 6 1. Is it 6? Oh, yeah. Who has 6 Hutton Hudson, right? Okay. Mario. This is a great counter pick. Okay. Mario Rob. Really good counter pick. Uh. It's pretty much the same exact thing as I said about Falco, except on a better character like Mario. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's see how um, the raw player will adapt to it. Charles, yeah. Charles. Wait, is this the Mario? I have no idea who this character guy plays, actually. Whoever plays, whoever's in the game name is D-Cat, plays Mario. I have no idea what this one. Yeah, thank you. I don't know who this one is. What time is it? I don't know where my phone is. Oh, is this my phone? That's your phone. That's my phone, yeah. My cellular device has gone missing, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, it's right here. Almost 7.30. Alright. Alright. Not late at all. Oh no, wait, actually, where is my phone? Is it in here? It is not in here. I don't know where my phone is. That is a troublesome. Oh, this is... Oh, I know this is. This is, um... Oh, I forgot this guy. The Masta or something like that? I forgot. They play, uh... They play Kirby Meta Knight. Interesting. He played Mario earlier, that's all I know. I thought he played Mario, but I guess he's not. Okay, my phone is just something. Yeah, it was fine, dude. 
So, Meta Knight's a character we don't really see too often. Uh, Although, in my personal opinion, it's still very strong. I can imagine. Wow. I mean, we all remember those, like, weak one Twitter combos we saw. Charles is maintaining a lot of control. Don't forget the up smash. Not quite in percent range for that yet. But up smash out of shield. Wow, okay, so what is it? 5 4 now? Yep. Or just getting closer and closer. Drunk, Drunk Gang is not out by any means. Good job catching the lineman. That's interesting. Top might go too high for Menelite. Huh? Menelite could just be standing and Top could fly over him sometimes. Yeah. Very short character. Probably very annoying to fight because of that. Also, the fact that he has to get 50 to neutral, where it's like, yeah, the other dash tag, dash grab. You know, yeah. So that's Same thing as Smash 4. Yeah. Although, doesn't get as much reward yeah. off of it. Still gets a lot, but not usual kills. Yeah, the 4 is a lot. 0 to death now, just like, I don't know what he gets off of it. A kill, yeah, he, like 80, he probably. probably. He probably could, but it's more like, oh. Ooh, that was good. That's clean. Charles definitely put it in work here. That is dummy, dumb, dumb strong. Yeah. That is ridiculously strong. I really don't know where my phone is, and I am terrified because that is a, my phone. That is pretty important. So, on their last player now. I think it's the Leaf Fit. It has to be, yeah. Yeah, 100% is the Leaf Fit. Yeah, my cellular device is somewhere, and I can't. So, let's see if uh, Grunt Gang can do this. If, uh, if this player takes Mennonite's last stock without any casualties, I, I think. I mean, even if he does lose a single stock, he'll be in a deficit, but. We can Not that it's definitely still doable, yeah. It's, oh, yeah. You gotta remember, it's Leaf Fit Trader, damage output is redonkulous. You really like that word, huh? Redonkulous. Redonkulous. I like it. Run off the stage twice. And the crowd has initiated the beginning of this match. On FD? Okay, so like. Something that people don't understand is that, uh, or I mean, maybe they do if they watch enough Meta Knight, is that Meta Knight gets a lot of flat extensions now. Let's see, like, that doesn't work anymore. You need platforms to get that. The dimensional cape. Tra Ooh. Trading with it? Launching with that. Strange. Strange oh, interaction. Soccer Ball does a lot of damage. It's like 14, I think. Leaf Fit is low key, really good character. Yeah. Like, no one, like, Super notable plays her. John Numbers is back in action with her, but he doesn't really travel as much as he used to, so it's hard to see representation for her. Now, spawn off the platform with Limit. See how, uh, see how Knight deals with it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Still keeping him off stage. Oh, it's bad. See how far he can push us. This is bad. That was that was crazy. He might just end it right now. They don't even need stir. It's basically, it's almost an even game. Oh. He saves him. Homie He's stopped. like, I'm not done with you yet. He wants more, bro. Oh, oh! Very good bait with the uh, air dodge there. You have to read on the ball. Oh, that hitbox is as big as. Nice, nice. See if he can kill him here. That oh. soccer ball almost. That's it. Very good stuff to uh, Mid Hudson. Taking it 4 0. Very good stuff. Buck Gang was starting to get back, but the